Uh, <laughs> so y- your favorite rapper retiring? I know, man. I hope he just bullshit. Ooh. I hope he trolling. Ain't hey, my Dolph. favorite rapper, but Young Dolph coming, said he retiring after Dumb and Did Dumb he do too. that before? And he came out with an album? No. Why are he retiring though? Isn't there, is anybody <laughs> know why he retiring? I'd be the same shit. He probably don't. Work. I mean, a lot. The rap game ain't like it. Like how people think it is. Like a lot of niggas. A lot of them niggas don't even want to be in the rap game. They just drop music because they have fans and want to make money. Of course. But, they don't really retire from rap. That's what I'm saying. They, they you, you know, you, you yeah, you know you're gonna drop something. You, you know what I'm saying? That, so, yeah, build that uh, suspense up and come out with that. But I feel like they ain't really tripping because them niggas up, bro, right now. Like, so you, oh, so that's what I'm about to go. You think they they the best rap duo on the rap game right now? Nah, not the best because it's a it's it, but they but they Dolphin, they at least it, right as far as right now they at least debatable top three but for sure top five. It ain't that many. Who's, yeah, that's what I'm saying. But you compare everybody though. Yeah. I'm talking about because yeah, one of my first two favorite too. Who? Young Thug and Gunna. That was one of mine's favorite too. Little and then well, you, got, you got you got you got Gunna. You got Gunna and, and Lil Baby. You got Gunna and Lil Baby. Then you got you got Future and Young Thug. I mean, yeah, not Young Thug. I mean, Future and Uzi. You got Future yeah, and Uzi. Okay. I feel like I don't be listening to none of that do, shit. Uh, like, do uh, uh, do Future and Drake count sometimes? Uh, no. no. Oh. Future and Drake do that count? No. Wow. But they came out of album though. They that was let's talk about it. Could count because it's, it's, it's a kind of they kind of got a current. You, you, you got to look oh, at. Oh, they do got the uh, board. What about? Uh, and then, hold on. They, if that's the case, then I throw one out there. You got Kanye and Jay. You got the baby. You got the baby and Megan Stallion. Nah, you, you got to look at that. You do got to know. Are you listening to them? No, 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 but I'm saying I'm talking about the duo that go hard together. Cause think about it, if you put Megan and, and Cardi B together, then you what? putting them ahead of ahead of Young then Dolphin. Well, they only made one song. We're not going off of that. We just saying who we think the duo. That's all. That's the oh, that's what the question is. Like today and oh. time, you know what I mean? Who I thought who do you she, think would make a fine duo? I thought the question duo? was who who you think? Cause you said debatable top five. I was I was asking oh, yeah. who you think is better uh, than them. Oh yeah, no, nah, oh, we only talk about debatable top five. Then no, nah, hell no. Nah. I was just giving examples of like people to consider. Yeah. Yeah. But nah, they definitely ain't in. That's what I'm saying. Current, who's who's ahead of Young Dolph and Keyboard right now? Uh, Peace Nation. Facts. I probably Facts. say uh, Gunna. Peace Nation. Turn up. <laughs> and uh, the that's Dolph. like an unbeatable combo. Yeah. yeah. Because they rap styles are so similar. They is. Young Dolph, they be dropping some heat too, though. But I can't stop. I can't. I can't really stunt though. That dumb and dumber too. That that shit. Like to me, like I, I said, listen to it. It ain't no oh, skills. No. That was a good. We for, oh no, that that was fire. That was just. But then if we gonna go to them. We got we gonna have to keep going on back and just talking about. Huh. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Okay. Yeah, we can talk about a wasn't lot. Wasn't of- Chris with somebody at one point? Like, he was out. Chris who? Well, I remember Chris, Chris T Pain. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Chris T Pain was a, was a thing. Not really. We go ahead. Chris, Chris Tiger, Tiger. Tiger. Oh, that's yeah, what I was going to yeah. say. And Big Sean one time. Man. But I'm saying, well, like, okay. current. Okay. Yeah, okay. current. Yeah, You're going to have to give it to Dolphin Glock, man. They really they really doing their thing for real, like, and it make me kind of, it make me kind of hate the way music kind of set up now because it's just kind of like, I feel like albums shouldn't be as important as they are. Like, well, not they shouldn't, but it shouldn't be like, a, music shouldn't be judged like that. You know, it should just be a word like projects. Like, okay, it this is, is this project, but, but you get what I'm saying? Like, a mixtape shouldn't be. You can't compare someone's hot single to someone who put out a 12 track album. But that's what I'm saying. If you have mixtape and then you got an album, that's what I'm saying. You that got 14 song mixtape mix and mix you got a 12 song album. If your mixtape goes hard but your album didn't do that well, I feel like it shouldn't be a difference between them. You get what I'm saying? It should be more of a, this is a project and this is a project. It shouldn't be, a, oh, it was an album, so it should have been better. You know, you have more, like, nigga, anything you put out should be worked on. Yeah. You shouldn't just be yeah. doing, no, you know, oh, well, nah, mixtapes yeah. like, that's a mixtape song. Mixtape is you know? more free-flowing, though. I, no, I, like, I, I albums, agree. Albums but are, like, work. actually calculated and, like. I agree, but that's what I'm saying. You should yeah. do that on every song. Even with mixtapes, you should think they should be calculated? But that's what I'm saying. I don't feel like it should be a difference. That's what I'm saying. Well, yeah. you get when what I'm saying. When it comes to rating it personally, obviously there's no point in holding them separately. Like, yeah, that, it's a personal yeah, thing. yeah. That's what you I'm can getting. Say at. a mixtape better than an album any day. Exactly. But when it comes to like the Grammys and shit, they don't recognize certain projects because they're not official. Like mixtapes. Yeah. 
our mixtapes, they aren't necessarily cleared or samples or anything yeah. or uh, yeah. like that. So yeah. you can't make you can out this shit. People make albums because they're specific. 100% like, yours type shit. Yeah, yeah. I got you. Like, specific, like, when, if you just throw in anything, like mixtape and shit like that, so like, it would just get completely out of hand. Yeah, because you know now you're paying like yeah. fucking five, six That's people because you don't got... think of an album, it's like, okay, you can make as many mixtapes as you want, but the album is like an artist saying, all right, this is like pristine. Like, this yeah. is something that I want you guys to judge specifically and shit like that. So, yeah. Hmm. That makes sense. But in a personal opinion, I agree with you. Like, I don't see a difference between mixtape mm-hmm, album I, I, I judge an artist based on their ability exactly to exactly exactly because exactly. i like i feel like it's a lot of fucking from any rapper you want to name it's a lot of underground or mixtape songs that should be glorified or get recognition but they don't because it's a mixtape song you That's get like, what i'm saying for instance i would say one example for me is Wiz Khalifa. Basically, yeah. almost everyone would say oh, his yeah. mixtapes. Exactly. Every mixtape he's made is yeah. better than every album. Exactly, album's. exactly. Yeah, I, I agree know. with you 100%, the, bro, the for Kushan real. The Orange Juice mixtape did get, like, remastered, I think. Mm-hmm. And, and I think he That's can monetize off of it now. Yeah, but it sounds different. Yeah, it does sound I, different. It doesn't sound it's, it's, it's like a couple yeah, of songs changed, like you said, because of that reason. Couldn't clear certain beats yeah. or certain samples, so they had to go back in and change shit. Yeah. That's crazy, man. That's crazy to set up like that. I mean, that's yeah, understandable, yeah. you know what I mean? Because you got to think about if you was on the other end of that spectrum. You made a song, you put out, and it wasn't that good. If somebody sampled your shit, and they make millions off your shit. Well, shit, nigga, that, wait a minute, that was my shit first. You know what I mean? So <laughs> yeah. I understand. It's just still a hassle. Yeah. Shit sucks. Mm. Shit mm-hmm. very much sucks. And speaking of sucking... That's what you're supposed to come in with. The- <laughs> oh, we didn't like that. No, I like the, no, I don't like the telling me how to do my no, job. No, no, I like the speaking of sucking part. This you just didn't like that. Off- no, nah, you just sucking. Nah, nah. <laughs> so, wait, did anybody else answer? So, how y'all, y'all, y'all fuck with Dolphin Glock? What y'all think? I mean, I'm not. Oh, yeah. I really I'm like it. I really like the new album. I'm not a big fan of Dolphin. I gotta go. I mean, I like Dumb and Dumber. I just haven't heard the second one yet, uh, cause I just ha- been, I just got through listening to Duke Deuce. I feel yeah. like this morning, um, I listened to it for the first time, and I felt like once I finished listening to it, I wanted to listen to it again. And I think it's like a lot of songs on there too, if I'm not mistaken. It's like, I think it's like it's better than the first one. Like that, man. Uh, first one was hard. I ain't gonna lie to you on that one. Low key, yeah. With yeah. ill and all that shit on there. Yeah. It is though, cause cause the first one it got like about like. Three or four songs I could kind of skip. This oh. one ain't got. This one ain't got none, bro. Like I yeah. probably could skip like one but, song on his own. Yeah. No, I ain't gonna lie.